Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video today and welcome back to the EFL Cup predictions. Round 2 is here already. Um, basically, same like I did the first time. I've chosen 12 fixtures out of a hat. Um, out of all the um, cup games. Um, I've said it once, but because the Premier League teams are coming into it, well, 13 I think, Premier League teams are coming in. Basically, what I do is I choose 12 games out of a hat, um, out of all of them. And the 12 that come out, I try and predict. Um, but if you, want, if you want me to do them all, please put it down in the comments below and I'll do them all in the future. I probably won't start doing them all to about maybe the 5th round, 5th or 4th round. So still a couple more rounds to go yet. Um, but guys, anyway, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching, and let's go. So the first game I'm going to kick off with is Bournemouth versus Forest Green. Now Bournemouth did not um, plan the first round, obviously being a Premier League club, but Forest Green did manage to get through to the second round. Um, Forest Green, you know, going to Bournemouth, it's a tough ground, but Bournemouth, I'm expected to play the boys. Um, Purely because of their league situation, you know, I want to try and stay in the Premier League. Uh, but I don't think Forest Green will get very far. So for this one, I'm going for a 2 0 Bournemouth win after 90 minutes. My next one is Lincoln versus Everton. Sat here, same as the last game. Um, Everton did not play in the first round, obviously being the Premier League, but Lincoln did, and uh, you know Lincoln did get through that first round. Playing Everton at home, uh, if you're a Lincoln Town fan, are you looking forward to this, or would you rather go up to Goodison Park? You know, a bit of a day out for you. Um, but as far as this game goes, I'm going to give it yet again to the Premier League club. And I'm going to give it a 3-0 win after 90 minutes. Just want to remember, last time I said extra time, I'll, after I watched the first uh, game live on telly, there is no extra time. So it goes straight to penalties. So that's how we have to remember. Um, but my next one is Newcastle versus Leicester. Newcastle are having a very dodgy Premier League season. Um, you know... Well, as Leicester seem to be going slowly up the table, uh, Newcastle seem to be going down um, slowly. Um, but I'm going to give this one a penalties, and I'm going to say a 4 3 penalty win to Leicester on pens. Um, the next one is Nottingham Forest versus Derby. Nottingham Forest winning two games out of two. In the league, and obviously I'll speak about more about that my championship predictions this week. Um, Derby, you know how we're gonna settle under their new managers. You know, there's a long way in this season. We all know that. But do you think Derby will be up there? Um, you know, pushing in the players. Please feel free to put it down in the comments below. And if you're a Derby fan, also put what you think. Um, but as this one, I'm going to go back to penalties for this one. And I'm going to go 6 5 penalties to Nottingham Forest. My next one is Crawley versus Norwich. Norwich Premier League side, uh, obviously being promoted to the Premier League uh, this season. Crawley doing ever so well to get through to the first round. Um, Crawley fans, please feel free to comment down below. How you feel about Norwich coming to your stadium? Uh, you know, you're looking forward to the game. Are you expecting anything from the game? You know, are you expecting to beat Norwich? Or you just got to go out and enjoy having the Premier League Club at your ground? Um, you know, put that in the comments. Um, but as far as the result goes, I'm going to call it a Norwich win. And I'm going to go for a 2 0 Norwich win after 90 minutes. My next one is Burton Albion versus Morecambe. Both teams played in the um, first round. 
I'm gonna call this one a Burton Albion win. I ain't gonna beat around the bush, and I'm just gonna go one nil. Uh, you know, I don't wanna, you know, beat around the bush with this one. I'll, that's what I've gone with a one nil scoreline for that one. My next one is Crew Alexander versus Villa. Yet again, a bit like Crawley. Crew have got Villa coming down to their stadium. Um, Villa opening their Premier League with three points against Everton. Yet there'll be more about that in my Premier League predictions this week. Um, Crew getting through the first round, and this is a bit of like a present if you want. So, you know. But I'm going to give us a Villa win. And I'm going to go for a 3 0 Villa win. My next one is Swansea versus Cambridge. Swansea ain't doing so badly in the Championship, nor is Cambridge in their division. But I'm just going to give this one the scoreline. I'm going to go for a 2 1 Swansea win. My next one is Rochdale versus Carlisle. Both teams doing very well to get through to the second round. I know a lot of you got to say, well, I played teams in the lower division and, and what these teams are, but you still have to play well to get through. Um, but I'm just going to give this one a scoreline. I'm going to go for a 4-3 after penalties to Carlisle. My next one is Southend versus MK Dons. MK Dons and Southend both plan in... You know, um, the first round, I'm just going to give this one the scoreline and I'm going to go for a 2 0 MK Dons win. My next one is QPR versus Portsmouth. Um, I can't, it might be a bit of a treat for Portsmouth fans purely because Premier League, uh, QPR used to be in the Premier League. Uh, but you, you're a Portsmouth fan, you're going up there, you know, tell me whether you are going, are you looking forward to it? Are you expecting anything from your club? But I'm going to go for a 3-2 QPR win for that one. My, ne my next one, my last one for the round 2 EFL Cup is Watford versus Coventry. Now, Watford have not yet won in the Premier League this season. Watford look like a team in trouble already. Um... You know, going up against Coventry City team who aren't actually, you know, actually money clear. You know, they've got their own problems. But I'm going to call it this one a shock. And I'm going to go for a 2-0 Coventry City win. But guys, I'm going to bring this video to an end. Guys, you know what to do. Give us a big fat thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Share for now.